Reporter Kristen Miranda joins us now, and uh, this is an area I know is ready for a change. Yeah, and this is a $25 million boost. Ooh. That's how much the cost. For juniors and seniors who attend JCSU, it was moving day. But for people who live in that part of town, it's a sign of what the future could hold. Mosaic Village opened with just the right amount of fanfare. Oh, we're all excited to move in. Because this project... I think this village will create independence for students. But more than that, it's a big deal for the northwest part of our Charlotte community. This is something that we've been waiting for for years. Just off the Johnson C. Smith University campus on West Trade Street, 300 students will live here. On the first floor, there will be a barber shop, convenience store, an express restaurant, all of which will be open to the public. And that connection to the surrounding neighborhoods? If we can revitalize the corridor, we can revitalize the neighborhoods around it. The mayor called it a down payment on the future of the West End Historic Corridor. It's considered only a beginning. That future includes, includes a streetcar. That, that future includes more retail. That future includes getting rid of some of the eyesore here. So today gives us a clear path to our future. Now the people celebrating here today are hoping for more public, more private investment. Charlotte cannot be the premier city it wants to be without the Northwest Corridor. It seems like there's some pressure on this project to change perceptions. Some people have a misconception about where the school is and they say, oh, it's in the ghetto part. And be a catalyst for even more. So we have a collective psyche, a very vital spirit, and we are determined to uh, demonstrate that the Northwest Corridor will have a voice. Now, this project is a public-private partnership. JCSU Instrumental here, along with the Griffin family, which operates Griffin Brothers Tire Stores. The West Trade Street Babies Ford Task Force is also behind several art projects in that area, mm -hmm. a bike share program in that area, some cleanup and restoration campaigns, so proof that this is a continued effort to make that part of town very special. They've been doing a lot, there is no doubt. Can't mm -hmm. wait. Mm -hmm. Kristen, Thanks, thank Krista. you. You're welcome. The Lifetime